Hi guys, welcome back to another video. How you all doing? Today's a car bang and we have, let's do a quick thumbnail. KFC, that's a crap thumbnail, but I don't care. It's hot, it's humid, it's horrible. It's, we're in the car. That's yours, my love. This is mine. We've got Mighty Buckets for one. We've got some barbecue bites. Mm. They gave us one fork. Luckily, we're related. Spicy Supercharger. Spicy, spicy. And, and, oh, the fries. I'll shove that in the back there for a minute. Oh. oh, they've all fallen out. Fuck. I'll beat that out. Beat them ones. <sighs> Everyone say hi to Brandon. Hello. 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 Bruh. Move this for you. There we go. How is everyone? How y'all doing? Good, I hope. How about you, how are you? Me? Yeah. Sore throat from the other night? It's not It's not sore, it's just, I've just lost it for some reason. Now the reason I asked Brandon on this car bang, muck bang, is because I wanted to talk about his performance. All the way up. Um, Brandon done his first performance in front of a live audience the other day. I mean, a proper live audience the other day. This is still not sitting right, is it? No. Oh. Excuse us while we fiddle about with the camera. Um, and why don't you tell them what it was for, what it was about? Well, it was not even for anything it was just for fun really okay and we did it with the college and yeah okay <laughs> so you did cover songs uh what songs did you sing well i sung oh uh, what lesson. songs were were played in uh, your set a lot a lot of john mayer because obviously Charlie Sylvester, he's a... Hey, Charlie Sylvester, big up him. <laughs> he's, a, he's a guitarist, and most guitarists um, orgasm when they hear the sounds of John Mayer. <laughs> so, <laughs> we had two John Mayer songs. Look at these barbecue bites. Uh, we did Through the Valley by Sean James, mm -hmm. which is a song that was on... The The Last of Us Part 2, I think. And um, I asked Charlie about it. I was like, The Last of Us, and you got it from that. It's like, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Didn't give us any napkins. Uh, yeah, some swearing or not. Um, yeah, what else did you sing? What else was performed, should I say? Did it. <coughs> A spice. It is spicy. Dancing on mine. By Callum Scott, but we um, made it more rock. Come in a more bit. Of a, more of a rock. So. Yep. And. Millie Phillip. The John Mayer songs were Last Train Home and Stop This Train. I don't know what it is about John Mayer, but he is obsessed with trains. <laughs> train spotter. I want to ask him is your favourite TV show Thomas the Tank Engine? And is your favourite movie Train Spotting? <laughs> and, um,. Because it's a cover, I can't get copyrighted. So I want you to show the guys. You can. Can I? Yeah. Oh, I wanted. Oh, mm. I think. I wanted them to see you performing. I th oh, we could try. I'll get a strike at least. No, you get a warning. Warning, strike, same thing. No, it's not. Oh, okay. See, I don't know nothing about this YouTube, my lot. A warning <gasps> is a warning you get. Like, don't do this. And then a strike is right. You've done it before, so we're gonna. Oh, okay. Fair enough. Trying to find it. We also did Feeling Good, but it was the Muse version. Mm. 
And, uh, oh my god, that is spicy. It's hot in this car. I can't have the windows open because it'd be too noisy. What else did we do? I I wasn't on the song, but I did Bruises by Lewis Capaldi. Well, Cameron and Monty. Montague Ellis. Mm -hmm. Did um, Bruises by Lewis Capaldi. Yep. Lewis Capaldi, if you don't know who that is, I quite like his voice. Oh. So, uh, where's the... This is hot. Let's stop this train. This was the uh, Dancing dancing on My Own rock cover that we did. I'm behind the lead singer, that one there. With his bass. That one there. He is a really good singer. Beautiful. And voice. then you? And then here's me singing for us an adolescent. Lean it in a bit, that way, forward. There we go. Put some more chips in there for me. Because half of mine fell out. Uh, it's basically the, the long and short of it. Yep. If you didn't know already, guys, my son, I'm biased, probably. Probably a lot you biased. Are, you are very biased. Um, because he's my son. But he does have a band, his own band, for the people that don't know. And what are you called? Bloodborne. And where can you be found? On every major stream. Yes, series. you can. We ask, we tell Alexa to put his songs on. They're called Blood Bond, and they're actually just starting out. So, if you hear them, give them a break. But also give them a follow, subscribe, or whatever it is. Download it. Yeah. <laughs> I have a bit of thigh here. Come on, get to eating, boyo. It's a mukbang after it's all. Hot in this car. It is hot in this car. <laughs> oh, hang on. Right, there we go. Okay. Please excuse the outside oh, noise. Oh, yeah, baby. It's far too hot in this car. And my aircon doesn't work at the moment. It needs regassing. So, yeah. I want to tell you guys how proud of a mama I am. Although I do give him some very honest criticism. Another amazing thing happened this week. My eldest daughter, she moved to our own place. She gone? She gone. She was looking for a long time and then COVID happened and because of her age, landlords weren't giving her a chance. And But it's one guy. He gave her a chance. So I'm happy for her. And she lives right next to the corner shop, so it's all good. She does live right next to a little store. What you guys call 7-Eleven over there? Yeah. She lives right next to one of those. Because the majority of your audience is American, isn't it? Mm-hmm. Yeah. Mm. We call it Co-op. Londis. Tesco. Express. Tesco Express. Mm -hmm. Jesus Christ. Um, <laughs> oh, I can't believe they didn't give us any napkins. I have a new um thing in my basket on Amazon. What's that called? Holder. Phone holder. Stand. A much better one. So I don't have to put something behind this one so it leans up. 
So yeah. <gasps> Got some hot wings here. Little drum. They're spicy today. So spicy. So pasta. What did the Italian babysitter say to the child? It's past your bedtime. <laughs> it's in the dog. Oh no, no, no. I almost died this morning, you saying that? Oh. We're playing cards against humanity. Has anyone played that game? It's something not for today's YouTube. No, God no. Um. Yeah, Cards Against Humanity. Savage, savage game, but funny. Oh, is there any napkins in the glove box or in that bag that you've got there? That's the chips, isn't it? Yeah. Damn. You don't ask for stuff now. You don't get it. You have to ask for everything. Okay, so Oreo, oh, Oreo Crush em, which is a milkshake. I've not had one of these before. Oh. Well, that was cold. <coughs> but, but. You said it was cold, you didn't say if it was good or bad. Oh yeah, no, it's alright. It's alright. I'm not really a fan of milk though, milkshake, that kind of thing. Do, can you drink milk out of the... Yes. Oh, no, cow pus. We once had a glass from the farm straight out of the milk. Uh, uh, straight, straight out of the, the cow. cow. Straight out of the milk. <laughs> straight out of the cow. What did it taste like? Fat. Oh, no. <laughs> mm-mm. Just pure fat. Gross. Like not even whole milk. Just pure fat. That's why I said ew. Cow pus. <laughs> I've got. I've got to get. I was. I was like. I've got to get me one of those. What a cow. Yeah. <laughs> Did you like it then? No. Was it sweet at all? It was flavourless. Mm. I think they add sugar to the ones when they put in the cartons. Pasteurised. Yeah. And Ooh. then to make it butter. 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 <laughs> butter. They churn it, right? Yeah. Stir it and stir it and stir it and stir it. Yeah. Basically. And to make it cheese, they do the same thing. They churn it, but they freeze it. And it makes cheese. Oh. Now it has been six years since I've been to a farm, so like anything I do say just. Yeah, but they're bound to do similar things. They're not going to change stuff, are they? I mean, American Farm... farms, you don't know about that. Oh, yeah, American farms might be different. Many of my, fa many of my friends out there, farmers. Far farmers? Oh, there, there's the first voice break of the, <laughs> of the, of the video. <coughs> Farmers. My my uh, grandfather was a farmer. We've got stereotype in England here. That all farmers talk like this. <laughs> and my granddad was one of them. Yeah. <laughs> my granddad had a right thick Plymouth Warden accent. Plymouth? He was born and bred in Warden. He was born and bred in Warden, but it's like sort of a Bucks Plymouth accent. Thing. Yeah, Bucks. So whenever I go in with with my dad, and uh, he used to sit on the it was a friggin sit awful. on the chair. Sadly, he's passed away, but rest in peace. Mm -hmm. um, whenever I used to go in, I used to sit um, on the sofa. The first thing he used to say to me, "All right, boy, how was school then?" It's one of the days. It's one of the days. I'm telling you. Bless him. I think he'll, Ooh, be, watching, he'll be watching me up there uh, on Wednesday. Looking down at me, performing, he'd be like, Oh, he'd be well happy. He'd be right. so proud of him. Me and Cameron. 
Uh huh. Yeah, his cousins also go to the same college as him. As him. And he was on the same performance as me. See, this is what happens when you have the windows open. All the noisy sods. Well, a Kia Rio was a <laughs> an exhaust about that big. Oh my bloody hair! Stop! I swear it, it has five gears. A Kia Rio. A what? A Kia Rio. I swear it has like five gears. Mm. You have five gears. Uh huh. I bet some people like to be boy racery and put great big bloody. Just, I've just exhausts and Americans are probably watching this like why is Brandon driving oh yeah <laughs> <laughs> I'm not driving <laughs> yet no they drive on the wrong side of the car <laughs> well I mean technically we do because I know the I'm majority, messing about. the majority of earth drives on that the side. right side yeah. yeah where we drive on the left because we're Elitist. Most of Europe as well, though, <laughs> drive on the this side, right? Right. Left, on the right side? Ah. Yeah. Oh. Italy. I Spain. couldn't ever. I think if I went somewhere and hired a car, I'd be so confused at road signs and stuff. Chicken! Adele boy from Only Fools and Horses. I'm going to get the RV and comes out the thing. Yep. He's like, Adele, what? You're driving on the wrong side of the road. Hmm. <laughs> I've been craving this and I knew I'd regret it after I ate it. Ate it. Ate it. Ate it. Bottle of water. Bottle of water. Can oh. I get you a bottle of water? Speak it. Oh no, that's not water, that's petroleum. Gas. Gasoline. Because it's just not that nice. Oh, crunchy, crispy chicken skin, and this just doesn't do oh, it for it's me. It's so good. What do you mean? It used to. That's the second voice break. I can't talk loud. No, singing has um, done him in. For the first time. He's got to rest his voice. For all my England peeps out there, my foodies, it's coming home. It's coming home. We, we were shouting that in the dressing room. Everyone got involved and I was jumping on the sofas. And I want your predictions on the football score tomorrow. What's is, your prediction? Is it tomorrow? Uh, Yeah, Saturday, yeah, tomorrow. For the American people that don't know out there, we're in the Euros. European Challenger Tournament. Yeah, football. Or soccer, but it's football. Um, and England are through to the semi-final. So, we're happy about that. We're against Ukraine. 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 Oh, Ukraine, yeah. Ukraine. And... You we just Ukraine. beat... And we, we're not allowed, we're not even allowed to the match. No, because it's in Rome, isn't it? And we're like, oh, England hooligans, bro. We... Mm -hmm. England football hooligans. To be fair, which, I don't blame which them. Which is true. I yeah. don't blame them. A lot of fights break out here over the football. I finished all my chicken. Especially the, especially the North London day. Yeah. Which is Premier League stuff. We get rid of the rubbish. This is the English, English League. A lot of fights happen in the English League. They do. Um, you can... What are you going to do? No, what was it? I don't know what I was going to say now. You completely put me off. Um, Post your predictions. Oh, yeah. I was going to say, what do you think the score's going to be? 3-1 if I'm honest. 2. England. I'm going to say 2-1 to England. Even though we beat Germany 2 0. Yeah. Because England football players get carried away. Have a tendency to get too cocky. Yeah. So I think they'll come into this match thinking, yeah, we're going to beat you, we're going to whoop your asses, and then Ukraine are just going to walk all over them. You got Harry Kane, though. And Harry Kane scored in the last match. Finally. What? He said in, he said in his uh, lispy voice, I'm very excited to be playing the next match. Uh, if I ever get very, famous very and he happy. sees this. <laughs> if I get famous and he sees this. Uh... <laughs> right. Last barbecue bite. Don't worry, Harry. 
Give for life. Give us some of that. Mm -mm. I parked, must have parked on the busiest street ever. <laughs> It's more like an avenue than the street. It's an industrial estate. I thought it'd be quieter than this. Anyway, guys, how are you? How have you been? What did you have for dinner last night? I can have that one. Mm -hmm. What did you have for dinner? Beans and spaghetti. I like getting my <laughs> ideas off my, my foodies out there. All right, see, uh, do a mukbang with spaghetti pasta bake. Or tiamini. <laughs> Cause that's what no I have done. what did we have last chicken wraps but i did uh, i did um some fried chicken wraps last night yeah but i can only really do this kind of thing when my daughter goes to school because otherwise it'd just be a nightmare and i know you you guys all love genie are we done Mm. Look how much barbecue sauce they put on this. Look at that. Look how thick it is. There's also another flavour called Nashville Hot. Yeah, I know. I was going to get it, but is it really spicy? Have you had it before? Oh. I prefer barbecue anyway. Yeah. It's tangy. Tangy. Tango. Drinks to you to tango. Right, you're going to have to drink some of that because it's melting. Brandon got an Oreo costume as well. I'm melting. The thing is, I'm, I am an Oreo connoisseur, Ooh. if I do say so myself. <sighs> They've changed the recipe or something. It doesn't seem very thick, it just seems like milk with Oreo, bits of Oreo in it. Yeah, and it doesn't matter. It's not matter. milkshake. It's Oreo. <laughs> it's it's not it's not a milkshake, it's a crushum. Which is a milkshake, right? No, it's a crushum. Right. Gotta get going. That's like saying if it had a ham in it, it would be closer to a British carbonara. <gasps> and if my grandmother had wheels, she would have been a bike. Do you know do you guys know who Gino De Campo is? If my grandmother had wheels, she would have been a bike. You would bash Google me it. on Willy on my foot. <laughs> right, anyway, we're going to head off because it's hot sitting in this car. And I'm hot and bothered. And now I'm very full and I need a nap. Because I'm old. But if, if you haven't done so already, please hit the like button and the subscribe. And the notification bell so you're notified next time I po uh, post a video or go live. Hit up Brandon on Amazon, YouTube, Spotify, Bandcamp. Tidal, Deezer. Uh... YouTube. <laughs> it said YouTube. Instagram. What is your handle on Instagram? Brandon Music? Brandon D Music or Blood Bond Official. Blood Bond Official. That's the one. But I'm out of here. We're like belly buttons. We're out. Bye. Yeah, you said the belly button thing. <laughs>